Stan Jabalisco here from the Black Hills of South Dakota. But I just got back from an extended vacation in the Wyoming area, Casper, Sheridan, and finally Cody in Metizzi, where I rented a wonderful little cabin from a place called the Cody Lodging Company. This is its website. And just so that I don't forget, I will highlight that, copy it, and then you can view it in the description of this video. I will provide a link. This is a really cool place. I like to go to Wyoming in the winter, but maybe that's just me. You know, I mean, I like to go when nobody else was there. And believe me, I, there is plenty of space. Hit vacation rentals if you want to go on a vacation rental. Hit all rentals. And go down, and here's the place I stayed at. There are a whole bunch of them. Some of them in town, Cody. Some of them out of town. Some of them way out of town, like this one, which I rented, called the Stargazer Bunkhouse on the Stargazer Ranch in Metizzi, Wyoming. They provide some photographs in their site, but I also provided my own little set of photographs. And here we be, starting with the bathroom. The bathroom. What is a cabin without a bathroom? Let's go on. I, I took a bunch of photos in here. Here's the interior. There you see I like to sleep without covers. Look at that decor. It's really great. I love that color scheme. I love the whole ambiance of the place. There's my ham radio right there. And there is the Morse code keyer right on there with the food preparation apparatus and everything. Dining room table. Kitchen counter, there's the radio. I'll show you that in a little more detail later. The front of the cabin, there's where the guests stay, right here on the left-hand side. The right-hand side here is the proprietor's workshop. There's the guest side of the cabin again. Now, this, we, these were taken in late February when I first got to this place. Sunny and windy in Wyoming. Plenty of alternative energy potential. Great views. They're up high and they're way out in the middle of nowhere. Great for ham radio. There's the guest quarters, the wood stove chimney. That sure came in handy. There's another view of the panorama. Spectacular desolation, I called it. It's just what I wanted. There's the ranch proprietor's own house. Beautiful house inside. Just just absolutely the it's the west this is the real west people the real west there's the guest quarters again there's the proprietor's workshop again there's a bunch of stuff that you can cut up and burn if you want to stay warm you can also use the electric heat which keeps it quite warm by itself by the way there's big number eight my trusty old pickup just starting to get caked with the mud that was out there at this time of the year. The front porch. Another view here from the front porch. Inside the wood stove there in the lower left. Might be that the cowboy theme was just a little bit overblown here, but it's a really great place. Really cool place. Kitchen, of course. There's the ham radio. Portable ham radio, Yaesu FT-857D, standing wave ratio meter, deep cycle marine battery, all on the kitchen counter, Morse code keyer paddle on the, just barely visible here, on the dining room table. What would a radio ham's trip be like without something like that, eh? There's another view of the interior. And we're back to the bathroom, signifying that that is in indeed the end of my photo sequence but once again I would like to direct you to the Cody Lodging Company website and it's www.codylodgingcompany.com but again I have provided a link here in the description of this video until next time Stan Jibalisco space traveler extraordinaire or unextraordinaire saying so long until the next time, have a good day.